Happy Saturday, everyone. Welcome to This Is It Team. 90 Day Run to Senior Director, Stephen Gina Merritt, coming to you from West Palm Beach. Guys, today is a very amazing special day. One, because we have the amazing dear friends, um, Heather and Dave Warden from Tulsa, Oklahoma, are going to be just rocking it today, giving you one hour of power. I'm telling you what, it's going to be incredible. And secondly, we get to find out today whether we're having our seventh grandchild is a girl or, or a boy. boy. <laughs> <laughs> so, hey, we're just having fun, guys. What a blessing this business is. We had the pleasure of having the Brandon family here yesterday with fellowship and lunch on their way home from vacation. We are so blessed that they stopped to see us. I'll tell you what, they are rocking it. They are fired up. And get ready, guys, because 2024 is going to be Bigger than you ever thought. Yeah. And I hope this is your wake-up call because we want to rattle everyone and get you fired up and alive and running hard. And, hey, we're here to help you. We're here to run with you. And I'll tell you what, you got amazing leadership throughout. This is a team that is rocking it and taking their time to help each one of you guys. Hey, we're blessed and highly favored, and we're excited that you're with us today. So we're going to get uh, go through a few uh things real quick before we get uh, David and Heather, Heather on. And these guys are so fired up and excited and they are going to give you some wisdom today that is going to rock your business. For those of you that implement it now, I will tell you this much too. As long as you've got people on here, your business is going to get the, have the compound effect. That's it. The book of the month this month by Darren Hardy is all about compounding the numbers, but you've got to have people on the Saturday trainings to compound your business. Otherwise, it, at the beginning, it's just you and your wife or you as a single building your business, kind of like a career or profession. But once you start implementing, putting people on these Saturday trainings and getting them to our events, that is when the compound effect takes effect and the numbers go wild. So um, I'm saying that because you still got plenty of time to text the That's people right. on your team. Call someone on your team. They've got to be on today's training for them to take their business to the level that they want to make it happen for their family's dreams. So our and goal. You, and you know what? This, when we talk about this, the, the, the compounding effect, having people on this Saturday Zoom, this is called working smart, yeah. not working hard. And that's what we want you guys to do. Work smart, not hard. And you know what? When we first heard of this industry and started, we had careers, but we made it a priority. So this Saturday is like a priority. You've got to, you know, you've got to make sure that you're on the Saturday trainings. I'm speaking to the choir, but you got to teach your team <laughs> yeah. to do the exact same thing because we want you to see the momentum. I mean, if we told you what is happening, I mean, it is wildly <laughs> insane what is going on for the people that get putting their team on the Saturday trainings and coming to the events like Believe Convention that's coming up in July. So uh, I believe that there's a lot of people putting about 60%. They got 120% in them, but they're only putting in half, about 60%, meaning that you still got your career. I mean, I remember the last run where we had a, helped 174 friends make a million dollars or more. My boss did not even know that I did this. That's right. So think about that. And we were the face of the company. And it was, we started just like this one. It was about a $100 million company. And we put we made it a priority. So we're good. We're showing and teaching you and we're right there living. We never forgot what we had to do, but we did make it a priority. So we encourage you to, your goal is to get, is to use your, your influence. You're, you're learning how good you are as an influencer by how many people are around today. If you got one person, okay, you're pretty good. You got somebody, but yeah. the key is, is you got to get the numbers of your team and not just your personals, mm -hmm. but everyone in your organization on the Saturday trainings, the better you get at it, the more your business will explode. That's I'll tell you right. that right now. So uh, our goal is to get everyone to senior director on a fast track. We are popping ranks, just hit the highest rank with uh, Devin and Sarah Robinson last Ooh. Sunday night. So it is wildly insane what's happening. And we want to make sure that you are part of this momentum. The fact that you're building right now is very smart because the momentum is happening. That's it. Uh, yeah. I was just told on our SPD call the other day by David Schmidt that this company is growing at such a rapid pace. There's no company out there that has had this kind of year to year, month to month growth at all in our industry. So it is perfect timing to get rocking. We're ranked number one from Business for Home. We're the number one fastest growing team per yeah. David Schmidt, Ryan Barson, Garrett Johnson. Nobody is rocking this 
faster than our team. So if you plug into what Dave and Heather teach you today, they are right there on the cutting edge with exactly what we're doing. Our goal is to get your manager. You could do that before the end of the weekend. If your boss said, I'll give you $10,000 to put two people right, two people left before the end of the weekend, you would do it for your boss. Would you do it for your kids? Yeah. It's up to you, right? Uh, our pro strategy is what David and Heather are going to talk about, so I don't need to. We're patching, calling, and we're uh, for as far as the P, we're revisiting or following up. They're going to tell you a little bit of how to do that. And then we're pointing to the opportunity, these the Zoom trainings throughout the week, or you be the opportunity. This is so simple. Hold the patch up. Wear the patch. We love the fact that it's a wearable. Okay, here is our, uh, our script. David and Heather will go through that. Going manager is so, uh, it's just two right, two left. That is your goal to get that done. And right on our website, it's a copy and paste, okay? Everything you possibly need to know or set people up. So you're busy doing your job. You just sponsored, say I sponsored Gina. I can copy and paste from thisisitteam.com, how to go manager, four videos. So I don't even have to do the training myself. There's four people, different personalities teaching your how to go manager and the cheat sheet to fill in how to go manager right on there. So on my way to work, or when I'm uh, on my break, I can do that without having to teach her myself and get her up to speed. Now we've got, if you believe manager is easy, going director is just as easy. You're just going to help two people, one on the right, one on the left, go manager, and you're a director. Senior director is just help, helping two people go director. They can even be on the same side. So start believing that you are going to achieve this and get this done and, and drop the people into these trainings. When you have them in these trainings, they know exactly what yeah. to do, and then they, you can't stop them. But if you're the one trying to motivate them, you're going to find out that that is a very slow road to make it happen. They got to be on here listening to someone like David and Heather, like you're going to today. Here are the cheat sheets. Start with manager. Don't get overwhelmed by going to all of them. But all this information is on thisisitteam.com, uh, which is our Diamond 2020 vision. Nobody taught this strategy before the company, before our team came on board. And the company is growing now at such a rapid rate, like we said all because we started teaching the 20 right, 20 left. We got our Believe Convention coming up. I'm sure David and Heather are going to mention this, but I will say this much. If you're serious about getting to the big bucks, if you're serious about building a big business, you should already be uh, signed up. You can't be a flight attendant without going to flight attendant training. You can't be a pilot without going to pilot school. You can't be a doctor without going to medical school. You're not going to win and be big unless you're at this event and remember, the corporate teaches you how everything you need to know about the patches and what to do with the patches and where the company's going. But these conventions here set you up with doctor's panels. Wait till you hear this year's doctor's panel. Yeah, they, We set you up with the strategies of exactly what to do and how to do it. And the energy in the room will drive you and your team. But remember, if you are already signed up, which you should be, your goal is to bring people to these events David will explain that even more with the way he can not can do. He's an incredible yeah. teacher as far as why you need to have the people in that room. But I will tell you that you will not experience the compound effect without the people in the room. We've got a new testimonies uh, section on our This Is It info <laughs> that is incredible. So you can share with people uh, and help your business grow even faster. But we're excited now to be sharing with you great friends of ours. And uh, we are just on the tour with them, the Wake up call tour yes. throughout uh, Oklahoma. And they Couple rocked stops. it. Yes. Was, the meetings were insane. I've had people from their team calling me saying, Hey, I am ready. I didn't know it was going to be this big. I'm ready to rock and roll. I would encourage you to do that with every person you've ever called or spoke with or sponsored and say, Hey, I am sorry. I did not know that it was going to be this big. And we don't want you to miss out and get on today's call or get them moving toward going manager. And hey, I'm telling you right now, grab a pen and a paper because you want to write down. You remember way more when you write it down, especially me. I'm telling you, you remember 90% more. I got my notepad and my pen. And hey, we're at the top rank, but I am on every Saturday yep. taking notes. Whether you're running around doing errands, you're busy, you're cleaning your house, whatever you've done, you got your earbuds on. Let me tell you what, you're going to soak in some great information. So without any further ado, please help us welcome from Tulsa, Oklahoma, Dave and Heather Warden. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hey, hey, what's up, everyone? Can you hear us okay? Give yeah, us a call. Great. All right, all right. Well, Gina, you're right. You know, look, we took a lot of notes, too, because... 
we wanted to make sure that we brought value to you guys. We wanted to make sure that we didn't forget anything. And have you ever like, you know, been thinking of something and you're like, darn, I should have written that down. That was so good. And so I've been doing that lately. Anytime I think of something that I feel like needs to be shared or taught with everyone on here, I just start writing it down because as it comes to my mind, that's that's when it's the perfect thing. I think God puts that in on your heart, in your brain. And that's when you, what you're saying, what you're supposed to be saying. And then sometimes you go back and you're like, well, darn, I'm not saying it exactly the way I said it before. So I made sure that I wrote it down so I wouldn't trip over myself or think, what did I say? It was so much better the first time. So anyway, thanks, Steve and Gina, for having us on. We're David and Heather Warden from Tulsa, Oklahoma. And thank you guys for really for doing that tour. Our business has just skyrocketed after you guys went on that tour. You're just, you know, I always say this about you guys. No one can outwork the two of you. Your relentless leadership is just bar none. I mean, I don't know how you did it for 14 straight days on the road, hotels, all that stuff. So yeah, we, we appreciate you guys so much. And that new testimonial page is incredible. I mean, I just, it's top not sharp. If you guys haven't been there yet, definitely go there and check it out. Watch a couple a day. Um, it will resonate with you and then you'll come across somebody in your path that you can share and bless. So uh, thank you so much for doing that. Yeah. So uh, on today's training, you know, we're going to focus on a word or a theme, if you will. So stick with us until the end to see if you can figure out what that word is. So, you know, 20, 21 months ago, when we got the phone call from our good friends, Mike and Sahi Hernandez, we had no idea what was going to happen over the next 20, 21 months, how our life was going to change, not just physically, but financially. So this has been a huge blessing. So we just appreciate you asking us to get on here and share. We always get nervous, like, oh, are we going to say the right stuff? Because every trainer you guys have on here is just amazing. Alan Sherry Hoover last weekend just crushed it. So we're always like, oh, crap, we got to do good. <laughs> you know, we got to keep up with these amazing speakers. So we hope that we bring the value to you. So obviously, if you are here today, I'm sure that you already believe in X39. And I bet that you believe in your sponsor or you wouldn't have even joined with them. And I guarantee you, without without a shadow of a doubt, I guarantee you, in fact, believe in Steve and Gina and their relentless leadership, their heart, their generosity. I mean, it's just you have the best leadership with them in the entire industry. Why do you think LifeWave is the number one momentum company right now? And why do you think Steve and Gina's team is the number one team in all of LifeWave? 43 SPDs that they've broken on their team in the last 20 months. That is unheard of. So anyway, so that's what we're, we're, we're picking a word and we're going to focus on that word today. And so hopefully at the end of this, you will know exactly what that word is. Do you have <laughs> anything you want to start with? Uh, I'll let you go ahead. Let's talk, let's talk about the first bullet point. Okay. There. All right. So here's my question though. Do you believe in yourself? Do you believe that you can build this business? Well, that's our goal today because we want to show you that you can build this business even if you don't yet believe in yourself. And this and this is the part that I wrote down because I was as I was thinking I thought, okay, this is too good. I can't trip up over this. So I'm going to I'm going to make sure that I I'm kind of reading this word for word because if you if you wait to believe in yourself before you talk to someone, eventually you're going to look at your results or maybe lack of results. And your results are going to affect how you feel about yourself. So if you're waiting to go help others or bless others before you believe in yourself, and but then when you go to check how you believe in yourself, you look at how many people you've impacted or talked to, and you haven't impacted anyone because you're waiting to believe in yourself before you go talk to someone, you just kind of end up in this like perpetual loop. And that's what we don't want you to get in. And look, we know it can be overwhelming, especially if you're brand new at this business. I mean, if you think about, oh, I have to know everything about the product, which you don't, or I have to know everything about the comp plan, which you don't, or I have to know everything about, you know, this is it info, all the patents, all the, no, you don't. You send people to this is it info, or, or I got to know everything about this is it team. No, you don't. The system's there. The structure is there. So just don't look at the elephant. Don't look at like, how am I going to eat this elephant? Just do what you can do a little bit every single day. So you got anything you want to add right there on that point? Yeah. One takeaway that we want you to walk away with today is just to keep it simple. Um, one thing that I did, you know, our kids now, we've got a 21 year old and a 17 year old. No way. We don't have, they're not that old. <laughs> but when they, when, when they were first born, one thing that I wanted to, 
to do was to stay active so that I could keep up with them. I didn't want to be one of those moms that was like, oh, I have all this baby weight. And I had this lady who was a trainer at my gym who had three boys who were all like below five and below. And I thought, I'm just going to take all of her classes. I'm going to do exactly what she does because she looks great. Like if I look like her after I have these babies, I'll be happy. And that's all I did. I just went to the gym, took all of her classes throughout the week and was able to keep, you know, the baby weight off after our, after the kids were born. And so that's the same thing with this is it team. We just look for that leader who's ahead of us. Um, Devin and Sarah Robinson are a great example. They just advanced in rank. And so I'm constantly watching what they're doing. It's not rocket science. You just watch that person that's a little bit ahead of you and do what they're doing. Plug into what they're doing. Plug into the team. Watch what Steve and Gina are doing. Um, just keep it simple. Every single one of those leaders, the 43 people that have hit SPD, just watch them and take what you what you can get from each one of them and implement it every single day. So a couple on our team, Kevin and Emily Wilson, yeah. said it best. They said, Steve and Gina Merritt are great at promotion. And that really resonated with me because that is so true. If you watch what Steve and Gina are doing, they're always pointing to the next event, the next thing, what can they plug their people into? Because the last thing you want to do is to hop on a call or go to a, a live event or go to a big convention and not have your team with you and not have anything next to plug them into because you get this momentum and then it just, you know, just does a nosedive. So you want, always want to be pointing to the next thing. Yeah, actually, Kevin and Emily said it best. You know, it's like if you're swimming, I can't remember exactly. I don't want to screw it up. They said something like if you're swimming in a current that's like, yes. you know, three miles or, you know, two miles an hour against you, but you're swimming three miles an hour, you're getting ahead. But if you stop, do you stay at the same spot? No, you don't because the current's pushing you backwards. So you just want to be doing a little bit each and every day. And so when I mean, you think about it, have you ever wondered why two people in the same industry with the same system, tools, education, produce two completely different results. One seems to just be absolutely crushing it and another may be getting crushed by it. Well, I don't, I believe that it has nothing to do with maybe their background or their education or skills or even luck. We believe that the person that's crushing it is just simply knowing how they, they know how to act a C T and that's an acronym action consistency and time. So I want to talk a little bit about that. So a, the action, well, what is the action? It's the income producing activities. You have anything you want to add on the income producing activities? I thought you wrote maybe something down on that. Well, so as far as action goes, we're really encouraging everybody right now to double down on their activities. We're starting this 90 day run leading up to convention. And it's a great time to, if you want to double your business, how do you do that? Just double down on your activity. So if you're doing one launch a week, whether that's in somebody's home or whether that's a Zoom, make it two. I'm not going to put you in a box and tell you how many to, how many you should do, but just double whatever it is that you're currently doing. Um, if you're patching three people a day, patch six. Again, that's just a number. If you're following up with three people a day, follow up with more. Yeah. So action, A-C-T, action is the A. So you want to be doing those income producing activities. And what are the income producing activities? P-R-O. You're going to patch, you're going to revisit, and you're going to send people to an opportunity. Now, I'm going to date myself when I say this, but do you guys remember the Frosted Flakes commercial, Tony the Tiger? They're great. Okay. Well, if you do remember that, then this is going to make sense. Our system should be called Pro because you're going to be patching people, but you're going to be revisit, 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 and then send them to an opportunity. You know, we've probably personally enrolled pushing 100 people, whether it's preferred customers or brand partners, and probably 10 to 15 of those people joined us the first time we talked to them. So the majority of those people did not join us or buy from us until we revisited, revisited, revisited. So what is the revisit? The revisit is not just every time you talk to them, hey, you ready to sign up? You ready to join? No, the revisit is maybe sending something of value to them. So maybe you heard a great testimony from all these amazing testimonies that we're hearing on all these Zooms and then take a little snippet of that and just say, hey, I wanted to share, I thought of you, I wanted to share this testimony because I remember this was the same issue that you had. So you send it to them and you let that third party person 
kind of market to them for you because they're telling their testimony, but it's benefiting that person because that's what they had. So that is a follow-up. That is a revisit right there. It's not always about trying to get them on your team. How can you provide value to that person? The more times you follow up with them and eventually, because that's the deal, you don't want to get frustrated because you, you just need to know going into this that it's probably going to take multiple revisits before somebody makes that decision. I think I read somewhere 90% of all sales happen after five to seven revisits, five to seven follow-ups. So don't get frustrated if somebody joins you. They just don't yet see the value for themselves yet. It has nothing to do with you. Just remember, you're the messenger. You're the one that's letting them know, but everybody's busy. So just because they didn't join you the first time, give them time. You want to just keep continuing to reach out, follow up, revisit with them, send them value. And eventually they will see the value and they will say, hey, that's what did it for me. I'm ready to join you. So just that's the A as far as ACT. And remember to hop on these Zooms that are going on throughout the week. There's basically something going on pretty much every night of the week. And they're so important. We always try to be on. If we miss it, we're watching the replay. Because here's the thing. It gives you talking points. Like if you look back to, I think it was Wednesday's Zoom, Donna had a great testimony about bone loss and gum issues. And she had a tooth that was loose. And um, that's when you are plugging into the system and watching the Zooms, it gives you something to talk about throughout the week. So like, think about, like, I think of my grandma, for example, she lives in an assisted living facility. She's going to her breakfast, lunch, and dinner. She's getting her hair done. Those are the things she talks to me about whenever I call her. If there's somebody who's like a, a big, um, you know, golfer or, or tennis player, and that's what they're doing on the weekend. They're probably talking to you about those sports whenever they see you. Well, if you're on these Zooms, you're picking up little nuggets that are going to resonate with you throughout the week, and it's going to be easy for you to talk about, share a story. So really plug into to the Zooms that are going on. Yeah. And so the C as far as ACT is consistency. Now, John C. Maxwell, if you've you know, read his books or, you know, we got to see him live, he always talks about consistency. It does not have to be done all day, but it must be done every day. Well, what about when I'm on vacation? Every day. Well, what about when I'm sick? Every day. So it's just a little bit that consistency every single day. If you want to propel your business forward, make sure that you're reaching out to a few people every day. Make sure that you're following up or revisiting with a few people every day and make sure that you're pointing people to these Zooms. And like Heather said, just said, you can pretty much point someone to a Zoom almost every single day. So if they couldn't make it today, there's probably another one tomorrow. So that's C, that's the consistent. And if you look, if you think about it, consistency is key in any area of your life whether it's something you're trying to do physically, financially, emotionally, spiritually, in business, in your relationships. I mean, think about it. If you went to the gym every single day consistently, I bet you'd be strong. I bet you'd be in shape. If you ate a healthy diet consistently every day, I bet you'd be healthy. If you poured into your spouse consistently every single day, I bet you'd have a great relationship. I bet you'd have a great marriage. So consistency is key. You just got to do a little bit every single day. So just remember that consistency is the biggest one out of ACT. Consistency is the biggest one. Mm -hmm. And the third one, unless you- Yeah, I've got something to say about as, as far as consistency goes, Remember also to have a CEO mindset because it's really easy to just think, oh, I'm just going to get in and kind of wing this and see what happens. And, you know, if you don't have a destination in mind, think about it from a, a GPS standpoint. If you're new to an area or someplace you've never been before, you type the address into GPA, GPS and then you know your location, you know how you're getting there. That's what the system is. It's in place to help you win and to have that really take um, ownership of your business because and, and I'm guilty of this myself of saying, I'm looking for someone who will take my business to the next level, right? We all want, you know, a Steve, Steve and Gina, Gina. <laughs> my, Mike and Sahi in our business. But what's wrong with that statement? You know, at first it's like, oh, it seems harmless, but it's, it's, you're lacking personal responsibility of your own business. The only person who can take your business to the next level is you, the CEO, yeah, most people have kind of an employee mindset and that's okay. But when you get into this business, remember you're not in business by yourself. 
you are in business for yourself, but not by yourself. We as a team want to help you and your people get to whatever level they want to get to. So yep. great words. All right. So the T as far as ACT goes is time, especially if you're brand new at this. You've got to give yourself enough time. You know, I think I heard Tony Robbins say that people far overestimate what they can do in three to six months and they far underestimate what they can do in two to three years. So just like Steve, I always hear Steve say, give me 24 to 36 months and we will completely change your life. This is not a sprint. This is a marathon. You want to sprint on the 90 day runs, but you want to consider your business a marathon because- right. If you just give it a 90 day trial, you're not going to be in this business in 90 days. I don't, you know, I heard again, Tony Robbins, I've let, read so much of his and listened to so much of his. I mean, it's like, you know, a lot of people are like, oh, you know, they look at Steve and Gina or Mike and Sai, whoever is hitting the highest rank in, in record time. And they're like, wow, they're an overnight success. And you don't see what Steve and Gina have practiced in private to be rewarded in public for. They have practiced for years in private, 30 years to be rewarded in publicly. And that's what you're seeing. You're seeing the public of them hitting the highest rank in a super short amount of time, but they put the time and effort into it. They have that stick to itiveness, just like David Schmidt has with the, you know, X39, 10 years of research and development and four and a half million dollars. I'm glad David Schmidt didn't give up on that, you know, on the 38th prototype. You know, it's called X39 because it took 39 prototypes before he got it right. So just know that going into this business, you're not going to crush it day one or even in 90 days unless you've been doing this for 30 years like they have. If you're brand new at this, give yourself enough time. Don't beat yourself up. Just know that it's going to take time. Now, I'm not saying take your time. You want to have a sense of urgency. You want to reach out to as many people as possible, but just give yourself enough time and give your prospects enough time. Because again, when you're talking to them, them, they may not join you the first time. It may take three follow-ups, three re revisits or five revisits before they actually make that decision to join you. So, And goals are super important, guys. Um, if you haven't set a goal, if you're brand new, if you're just getting started, set a goal to enroll four people on a silver pack within 48 hours in a weekend. Just that should be your first goal. If you're really looking at this from the business side, that should be your first goal. Get with your sponsor. They are going to be your biggest cheerleader, or your active upline, and have them help you um, with that launch. But within 48 hours is a, is a good um, projection. And guess what? If you don't do it in 48 hours and you only got two, that's more yep. than what most people do in 48 exactly. hours. You yep. got two people. Yep. You know? So yep. just continue doing that. I mean, it's Keep just it simple, get good at patching people and get good at promoting the next event. Say the same old thing to new people yeah. all the time. That's mm -hmm. all the system is, is saying the same old thing to new people every single day. And so for us, we are addicted to the action, not their response. So think about that. Be addicted to the action and not their response. And so, you know, it, it's for us, it's like whenever we're talking to someone, so we may, you know, and here's a, here's a good example of maybe you haven't talked to someone in a while and you want to call them, but you feel like it's going to be awkward. Like, oh, you know, I haven't talked to them in a year or two years. And, and now I'm going to call them and, and talk to them about, you know, some stem cell patch, you know, that's going to seem kind of weird. So just, you know, just do this, just call them and say, Hey, uh, you know, I'm reaching out to you. I know we haven't talked in years or however long it's been. I realize that. And I would love to set up a time to catch up with you. But the reason I'm reaching out to you today, the reason I'm calling you today is because we are launching the coolest piece of technology in your area, in your market, in the Dallas area, wherever you're from, you know, whoever you're talking to. Do you know anyone in this current inflationary environment? Do you know anyone that you've talked to or maybe, you know, friends, family, whoever that's struggling financially, somebody that has said, I wish I could figure out a way to make an additional stream of income. Do you know anybody that would be looking to make some income from home part time? And then probably their response is going to be, well, what is it? You know, because you haven't said what it is. You're just saying you're launching the coolest piece of technology you've ever seen in their market. Do you know anyone looking to make an additional stream of income part time from home? Their response is probably going to be like, well, what is it? And then that's when you say, oh, do you know anything about stem cells by chance? And let them tell you what they do or don't know about stem cells. And then that's when you can go in and say, 
yeah, this piece of technology is a little wearable device, looks like a little round white Band-Aid. And I don't know if you know this, but by age 30, you're losing 50% of your stem cells. And by age 60, you're losing 90% of your stem cells. That's why everything heads south at 60, your skin, your energy, your sleep, your mental clarity. So whenever you begin to wear this patch, all that stuff begins to head north again. So do you know anyone that may, could benefit from that, you know, that would like to promote that in your area? And if they say, oh, well, shoot, that sounds pretty good. I might like to, because you're not putting it on, you're not asking them to do something. You're asking them if they know someone that could benefit from that or making additional stream of income. And then if they say, wow, that sounds really interesting. I, I might be, you know, oh, okay, well, let me send you to this website and it's this is an info. Go to this website. Do me a favor. Watch the first couple of videos that are on there and then get back to me. Let me know what you think about that, because if it's something that you do like, I would be happy to send you some samples of it. But while you're watching that, be thinking of who you know that would like to make an additional stream of income because you're still putting that out there. It's not necessarily about them. It's about maybe who they know, but they're like, well, I would be interested in doing that. And so that's the thing you're kind of you're not just directly asking them. You're asking that they know anybody. So do that if you haven't. If you haven't talked to anybody in a long time, that's a good way. Now, if you've got people like I think Alan Sherry Huba said this last weekend, if you've got people that you can just pick right up from where you left off, I think Sherry said that, that you hadn't talked to in you know a year and you just call them and you just pick up right back where you left off, call those people first. Those people are the people that are going to jump out of an airplane with you if you say, hey, let's go skydiving. You know, those that, you know, if you want that low hanging fruit is what they call it, people that will join you for whatever, because you have a, you have people that will do that. There, there's a few people in, in your contact list. And, you know, that's the thing, too, is I think a lot of people, when they look at their contact list, especially on their phone, because, I mean, pull out your phone and look at how many contacts you have. You probably have way more than you think. And if you're going through there going, uh, no, you know, they make a ton of money. They probably wouldn't be interested in this. If you're doing things like that, you're selling, you're pitching. You need to look at this as who can I bless today with this technology? Every I don't care how rich you are. If you don't have your health you need X39. And so it doesn't matter if they get a billion dollars in the bank. You're looking at it as you trying to sign them up into a business. Look at the look at it as how can I bless them with what I've got? That will completely build your business but organically without you feeling like you're trying to sign people up in a business. You're focused on how can I bless someone? You got anything that you want to yeah. And as far as, as far as how you're doing that, there's several different ways to um, reach out to your contacts. So you can host an X39 launch in your home. Um, you can point them to a Zoom. You can do a three-way call. You can do a one-on-one. -on -one. And what I would suggest is see what works best for you. Make sure that you're, make sure that you're tracking how many people that you talk to in a week or in a month. And how you reached out to them and of those numbers, how many, which, which activity was working best for you? For us, it's one-on-one -on -one with people. We do really good going over to that person's house with samples, talking to them one-on-one, -on -one, answering their questions and, and following up like that. So um, I always like to track how our work is going. Yeah. And you can kind of gauge someone's interest, especially, you know, what's funny is I feel like strangers give you more respect than your immediate family members do. Does anybody notice that? You try to talk to your, you know, your brother, your friend from high school. And they're like, yeah, I remember when you picked your, you know, what they said last <laughs> week, you picked your nose in seventh grade or whatever. And, and like, yeah, you're talking to me about a business. So sometimes your immediate <laughs> family members, you know, just, you know, talk to strangers and you can kind of guess somebody's, um, you can gauge their, their interest level. If they'll let you put a patch on them right then and there, then absolutely share some samples with them. And I always tell people, look, you know, don't expect three to five patches. If you're, if you're willing to do that, if you're able to share patches with people, I always tell them, look, don't expect three to five patches to change your life. Now, you know, because it took your body 30, 40 years to get in the shape that it's in. However, here's what I do want you to pay attention to, because some people might start wearing the patches 
for one specific thing. And if they don't feel that specific thing immediately, then maybe they're going to think, oh, well, I didn't get anything from it. So I point out three or four things for them to pay attention to if I'm going to share samples with somebody. Because, you know, to me, these things are like gold. I, and that's why I tell them, look, these things are like gold. I don't want to give these away unless I know for a fact you're going to wear them. So are you going to wear them every day? Yes, absolutely. Put one on me right now. If you're talking to somebody like that, you are you can bet when you give them patches, it's going to benefit them and you for your business. So, you know, make sure that you're telling them, hey, these things are like gold. You know, I'll give them to you if you promise me you're going to wear them. But here's what I want you to pay attention to. Yeah, you may have some aches and pains or discomfort somewhere that you're hoping that it helps. But pay attention to how well you're sleeping that very first night or second night. Pay attention to your energy levels. Pay attention to mental clarity, because these are some of the things that people feel immediately. So I want them looking for more things than just the one thing that they hope that it might help long term. And sometimes if it's a chronic issue that's been bugging them, a back or a knee or something that's been bugging them for 10 years, that might take your body longer to heal. So under promise and let the patches over deliver, but it's all about how you're setting up that initial contact with a stranger. You know, you want to make sure that they, and you can tell if they are, you can gauge their interest level. And if you, if they're letting you put a patch on them, then absolutely share patches with them and send them to this is it info and tell them you're going to follow up with them. So that's key on a stranger versus somebody that maybe you haven't talked to in a while. So we've given you three examples, you know, somebody that you haven't talked to in a while, a complete stranger, or that friend that you haven't talked to in two years, but you can just pick right back off where you left off from the, the last time. So those are the ways that those are the people that or how you can do it with those types of people. So hopefully you kind of got some value from that. But listen, what we hear affects what we know. And what we know influences what we believe. And what we believe impacts what we do. So even if you don't yet believe in yourself, we believe in you. Steve and Gina believe in you. That's why we're here. We're here to help you get going even before you believe in yourself, because that's the key is taking the action, A-C-T, take the action, the right kind of action, be consistent with every day and give yourself time. And one day you will be an overnight success too, just like all the SPDs on here, you know, whether it's a year from now, two years from now, three years from now, but you want to give yourself that 24 to 36 months, like Steve always talks about, because you, this again is a marathon. It's not a sprint. Do the 90 day sprint, do the 90 day run with us. And then all of a sudden you will believe beyond the shadow of a doubt, not in just the X39, Steve and Gina, you're up line, but you will believe in yourself and believe in this whole business model. So you anything you want to So do you want to reveal the word now? Well, I uh, hopefully so far. <laughs> does anybody think they know what the word is? Because if you do, <laughs> I'll tell you, it starts with a B. Anybody get it? It's believe. And the reason we the reason we wanted to talk about the word believe is because of the most important thing, you know, the believe convention coming up in July. Look, Steve and Gina did not just pull believe out of thin air. They know what they're doing when it comes to these conventions. Mm -hmm. They Spot on. There's a the reason they named it believe because especially like what we talked about, if you're brand new, maybe you don't quite yet believe in yourself. You want to, you want to build this business, but you don't know if you can, you don't know whether you believe in yourself or, but so that's why we're here. That's why they're having this convention. You absolutely must go. Every person that's hit SPD within this team has been to every convention. There's a reason. And does everybody know there's a difference between working on your business versus working in your business? So working in your business is the pro strategy, right? Patch, revisit, opportunity. Working on your business is going to be everything that you learn in Orlando in July. So that's a time when all of the leaders kind of slow down from working in their business to teach you how to do the business. So you want to take that time to work on your business so that you can then bring that home and work in your business. Yeah, because that's how it's that's how you're going to grow and that's how your business is going to grow. And that's where you get the belief. Again, that's why they named it believe, because you may and same thing with the patches. You may have started wearing the patches and, and maybe you don't yet have a testimony. 
So what you're going to do is hear everybody else's testimony. Just because maybe you haven't had a testimony yet, does that mean that the product doesn't work? Absolutely not. I mean, David Schmidt himself said 97% of the people that wear this patch for at least 90 days get a result. So maybe you haven't had that result yet. So your belief level comes when you hear other people's testimonies. So start sharing their testimonies until you have one. And then your belief in the product goes up and your belief in your business goes up as well, because now you're seeing your team start to grow from that. So absolutely before you after before this day is over go to this is it convention.com and make sure that you get registered for believe conference convention in july in orlando because that's where it's at the bread and butter the mm -hmm. the speakers that they're going to have at this event will blow your mind it will be the best investment not money spent this will be the best investment that you will ever make in yourself. And you know what? Yep. You can invest in the stock market. You can invest in Bitcoin. You can invest in all kinds of things and you can lose your butt. <laughs> I've done it. But if you invest in yourself, you will never lose. Yeah. And how you invest in yourself is you go to Believe Convention. And when you leave that Believe Convention, you will know beyond the shadow of a doubt that you made the best investment in yourself because of what you learn at Believe Convention. So look, that's our time for the day. Hope you got some value from it. You know, we believe in you. Steve and Gina believe in you. And I know God believes in you or you wouldn't still be on this planet. So do yourself a favor and start living like it today. Take care. God bless. Thanks, Steve and Gina. Appreciate you so much. Oh my goodness. I got so many pages of notes and man, you got some zingers. Wow. <laughs> like, holy smokes. This was absolutely a... Um, top notch, absolutely incredible. I could not have done better. No. I'm telling you what, this was a game changer for everyone. And the word is believe. Hey, we're so blessed to have you guys as friends mostly. Yes. And of course your leadership and what you're bringing to the table. Like we talk about all the time, every single friend, every single leader, every person on the, on the, this is a team. I don't care if you're brand new today. This is your very first event uh, training. Uh, we all bring something different to the table. You know, I mean, the confidence and exactly laying it out so clearly, you know, everybody needs a different person to speak to them. And and David, you and Heather did an amazing job speaking to so many people today, I'm sure, that needed to hear exactly the way they teach because everyone's got a different personality. Everybody's got a different uh, anal an 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 analytical way of telling the uh, how this works and the way you guys broke it down for everyone to understand it, making it so simple yes. that it's, oh, that's like an aha moment <laughs> on what we need to make things happen. I will say too, they were talking about Believe Convention at the end there, that uh, we made it so simple for everything. First of all, we made it affordable for everyone to attend and we've got, you can make a deposit. So you don't even have to like put all the money up. For, I mean, where can you really do anything like that where you can just slowly make payments as you go so you can, so you're making money and you implement what David and Heather just taught you and you slowly are investing in yourself. You don't even have to come out with it all at once. I mean, obviously you're putting it on your credit card. So you're putting a little deposit down as you're making more money, you pay that off and you put a little more deposit down and you pay it and you pay it down. So uh, we're doing everything we possibly can because we didn't forget where we came from, but we know one thing that in order to do what David was saying over those 30 plus years of us being in, when we were broke, we had to invest in ourselves. So we encourage you to really understand uh, that point of the business. And I mean, the belief uh, is just wild how important it is for you to have belief in the product, belief in the company, belief in the leadership, belief in yourself, most importantly. But it's going to come. I love the fact that David was talking about start doing the activity because that's going to create your belief. How can you even wait till you have belief if you don't even get started? So start and lean on David and Heather's belief, on Gina's and my belief, and your sponsor, your upline's belief, and you're going to see incredible success uh, And just by implementing what you were taught today. Thank you guys so much. It's absolutely incredible. So again, on the Believe Convention, this is the form. We're going to have these printed. They'll be up on the uh, website for you guys to print. All the senior presidential directors will get um, tear off pads shipped to their house this week. But listen, believe this is it. Yeah. So on Saturday night, we're having an amazing dinner celebration. So we're going to be at Believe on Friday and all day Saturday. And on Saturday night, 
you're going to attend belief dinner celebration because now you've received the belief. So, hey, guys, we're pulling out all the stops for each one of you. We know. And I, I was just like, I just want to cry yeah, this is because amazing. this is just guys. I did not know the name of the book of the month for April. Right. And I could just cry. I'm so emotional over this because I said, Steve, oh, my gosh. This is bigger than we could imagine. When we prayed for God's favor, it just completely gives me goosebumps, makes me so emotional. Danny's book is called Only Believe. <laughs> Guys, this no. is not a coincidence. No. I hope that you, you know, like we call our tour the wake-up call, but this has got to be your wake-up call. Yeah. This is not a coincidence. Everything is lined up. God has a big plan for you. When Danny McDaniel's book, I said, you know what, Danny, I didn't even know he had a book. He said, it's on network marketing. I didn't even know the name of the book. We had already named our convention Belief, and it, it's only Belief. I'm like, Steve, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I mean, when you pray to God for favor, you pray for all the things we prayed for. I mean, I, how should I be surprised? But sometimes I get like a boom, boom across my face that he is so big. But he wants you to win. And I'm telling you, I was just, I'm still emotional over it. Only believe. And here we are attending Believe Convention. This is the April book of the month. We're so excited and um, blessed to be having this. It's right on Amazon, guys. Start getting it. We, we've been starting to read it. We just got ours in. I'm telling you, incredible, incredible book. We're super excited to have him as a senior presidential director, him and his wife, Danny and Diane McDaniel. And then here we have his book of the month for April's book of the month. What a blessing it is to have um, the honor to have his book be the book of the month, Only Believe. And here we are going to be attending Believe Convention. So, hey, everything is lined up. God has the yellow brick road paid for you. You just got to stay on that yellow brick road. And, you know, so many of you, too, are maybe going through some stuff. I love that in the book, the subtitle where it says, on their last $130 and took it into over making over $40 yeah. million dollars in this industry so and i'll tell you this much danny will tell you we, he, we he's been speaking on our um, wake up call tour that he's never seen anything that yeah. he, we've ever hands on with the x39 that david and heather just spoke about and the, the the one product landing page this is it info never seen anything like it so and he's planning on far over more than 10 times he says he believes more than 10 times he's going to make with what we're having Absolutely. we got our hands on right here so this is a great way for you to basically take your excuses out because probably every excuse you might have is in his book because he only had 130 dollars in his pocket or or what he put down uh to succeed and you implement that with the compound effect that we've got with this Month's March book of the month, which is March. We should all be reading through it, understanding. I mean, come on, jumpstart your income, your life, your success. We're like, these books are so important. I hope you are taking it serious for you to win and succeed because you would be uh, blowing this up if you are really implementing what you're learning on Saturdays and you're learning from what is being read. And it's, and it's not only going into your brain, but your heart as far as what you can do uh, yourself. Make sure you've joined our Facebook page. It is uh, cranking all the rank advancements, all the information that you know what's coming up. Uh, the YouTube channel is all the replay today is going to be on there. Uh, get in your testimonies to us, you know, and help your team do the same thing. This is a team effort. We put this together. You saw Heather was mentioning the testimony site. Well, we need everybody's, we need another, we need another hundred testimonies on there yes, we so do. that we can share we because do. too many people are still looking for different testimonies. That's right. And by the way, just because someone's testimony is up there about some different ailment, we want you've got a too. different way of presenting it. That's just right. like uh, we spoke about presenting today. The tour is still continuing. There's going to be many more wake up call tour stops coming up, but we've got one coming up in Naples. Who do you know on the West coast of Florida? People are flying into these events from all over the country. So if you live in Florida, please get there, drive there, get yourself a wake up call and bring people with you. That is the key. Like Heather said, is you got to have people on our Friday launch zoom is going to be uh, Johnny and Kim Ringgold. They're on fire, oh, they're yeah. fired up, and it's only a 30-minute presentation. So these are the things going on this week. Thursday, we're going to be in Orlando for the launch wake-up call tour. Mike and Sai are going to be coming hot off their trip oh, to oh. Korea, where they had uh, in their organization through Brooke and Keston, Joey Michaels. 
uh, Joey and Courtney, they're going to have, they have uh, nine SPDs broke in the entire country of uh, Korea. Amazing. And this team, the This Is It team had seven yeah. of the nine uh, SPDs, highest rank, uh, all did it like within a month. So it's going to be wild what's about to happen. And they're going to be bringing that fire with you. They just left Puerto Rico where they're having humongous numbers, huge success. Uh, so many people already signed up for Believe Convention from Puerto Rico because it's on fire. So we're going to have a Spanish opportunity event starting at 6.30. You get there at 6, starts at 6.30. Make sure you're on time. Now, I I'm not going to talk to the Latinos. I'm going to talk to the, to the uh, English friends because Mike has already got the Latino friends so flat fired up. And he's like, got a challenge. Can we bring more than the English? Yeah, let's bring it on. Let's event? go. So how many guests can us English folks bring or send? You know, if you live in Oklahoma, everyone knows somebody in Florida. I mean, again, if your boss said, send somebody to this Florida meeting, I'll give you $5,000. You'd be like dialing for dollars through the Facebook, yeah, through yeah. whatever social media channel you could, and you would have them there. So put this effort into your own business this is not your boss's business yes and yes and flying in from uh minneapolis to orlando to bring his team from uh the villages yeah so it's gonna I mean, be it's wild amazing. Amazing. what we're seeing so i'm glad yasdin you're taking advantage you're going to show That's her right. show us Our some guy. good people there for that speak english but maybe they speak spanish i don't know point is it's going to be wild on thursday night I pray that you are planning on coming. I know people are coming in from Jacksonville. People are coming in from Tampa. It is going to be incredible on uh, in Orlando. The place is going to be on fire uh, starting uh, Thursday night at 6 o'clock. People are going to be arriving. Yeah. Of course, we're going to be doing the Wednesday meeting coming up this week, like we always do. We're going to be up early at uh, 5 a.m. Doing, doing Australia. The Australia. And a bunch of Australians earned the free trip to yeah. South Korea. So we had a huge team from This Is It team. Uh, Misha and Tessa on the team all earned free trips to uh, Seoul, Korea for their regional trip. Ours yeah. is coming up in Cancun. But these free trips are going on around the world, motivating people. I want you on there with us. And that's part of doing what uh, we learned today from David and Heather. Tuesday. I'd like, you know, this is actually a European type meeting. We help with the UK team on Tuesdays at three o'clock, but there's so many semi-retired people, so many people that got some freedom. Like Gina said, you could put this in your earbuds, put have a friend do it. Three o'clock on Tuesday. This is a great time. Everybody to, can to plug into this. Chair. Of course, it's eight o'clock London time, but you can put your European friends on here and your American friends. North American friends and listen to Javi and Olga Solis. They are going to crush it on Tuesday, but I'm encouraging you to put people on, take advantage. And then this Monday, two days from now, a double header, eight and 10 PM. One of the most serial entrepreneur couples that we've ever known in our life related uh, to Gina on her side of the family, Carl and Kathy Firestone are literally crushing it. Yes. And they're going to be speaking at eight o'clock Eastern time. And then back at 10 o'clock, to help everybody that's on the West Coast because the West Coast teams are growing so fast. You want to hear the message that Carl and Kathy have to share uh, uh, on how why they chose this industry versus all the other companies right. they've owned. They're saying they've never seen anything risk to reward like we're talking about here. Get your newest person on there. That's what Heather was trying to explain to you. You've got to have people on That's right. for you to win. And then they're going to be, of course, be doing a Monday motivational message right after the eight o'clock meeting. Here's our launch meetings that we got going on every single uh, week. And of course, like they talked about the Believe Convention, like I said, you can uh, just put a deposit down your goal. If you have already signed up, which if you're on here tonight, today, I'm sure you already have. Your goal now is to get as many people. You want to use your time wisely while you're there. How many people do you have learning how to build their X39 yeah. business? How many people are going to be in the seat, sitting in attention, learning so that they can take their business to the next level, which in turn will grow your business. And now you're having that compound effect instead of you just putting in the own effort and you're bringing all the information back to your team. You've brought them with you. That is your goal. There is limited seats. But I will say this much, you pack it out. Gene and I will do everything we can possibly do to put every one of your friends in and team members is what I'm saying. But I call them friends like Scott and Renita were just at our house. Yeah, we're business partners, but more so we're friends. 
How many people are you going to have there? We will do yeah. everything we can do to help have enough space for those friends. That's right. So, hey, I just want to remind you, let's just say I'm by myself. I'm single and I want to enroll, but I want to book a room of four. So I want to bring three friends with me, but I'm just starting and I don't have them um, enrolled yet. Go ahead and sign yourself up for the four room and you're going to put your name on every single four slots. And my daughter, Mia, posted something on the team Facebook page. At, after you fill the three other slots, you're going to send one email with the name changes to keep it simple for our staff and um, less emails. So, guys, it, it's possible, but it's going to sell out. Yeah. So don't wait. I'm telling you, if it's a husband and wife and you want to bring another couple with you guys, you're only going to be sleeping in there. It's so quick. It's so much fun. You're going to be just it's a power weekend that is going to completely shift your entire business and your family's destiny. I'm telling you, it's going to be incredible. So, hey, it has been a blessing to be with you. We are so excited. Thank you again, Dave and Heather, for pouring out, guys. This is recorded, and we are sorry that the YouTube was not up today. Just had a little technical difficulty. And once we start, we just have to keep rolling. It can't be popped on. But, guys, hey, this is recorded. Make sure you share this. This is a definite share to every single one of your teammates. I'm telling you what, what a blessing. Remember, your business is not until um, Sunday night at midnight. And do not forget Monday, double header with amazing senior presidential directors, Carl and Kathy Firestone are going to completely bless your people. They will get in. They do all the work. Listen, it's an open seat. You can have a hundred people, a yeah. hundred guests on there. So take it, um, like they said, Put the act, the action in it yeah. because we believe in you guys. Have a great rest of your weekend. Make it productive. Now is the time. Don't sleep on what we got our hands on. God handed this to us on a gold platter for every single one of you to win and succeed. And we, your family is counting on you. All you got to do is be uh, make it a priority every single day to be out there proing like David was talking about and pointing to the events and you being participating here because it is going to happen. There are people out there praying for you. The only person that knows that's going to speak to them is you. No one else is going to bump into them. They are counting on somebody speaking with them. So open up your mouth. That's right. Talk to the people. And it's so simple because we got, like David said, this wearable technology that everybody sees. Yeah. And even if they don't see you, just push, show it behind your neck or on your wrist, wherever you've got it so that people can see right away what it is. And then they're not scared. They're like, oh my gosh, that seems interesting. And then they want to learn more. So I we are super excited because we don't know if we're going to have a little girl or a little boy. Today, we find out our second daughter, Chloe, um, and her husband, Drew Diggins, we're super excited, guys. So, hey, is it girl or is it boy? <laughs> you guys tell us, all right? Guys, have a blessed day. We love you. And listen, we believe in you. And this is it. God Thanks, bless. Thanks, Dave, uh, David and Heather, for doing a, such an incredible job uh, with us, keeping us in suspense of the belief and the believe uh, topic that you had for us today. It was amazing. God bless.